Hello and welcome to Tonic HQ today. You've got me for a change. I'm Karen. I work with Alison upstairs in the office, but Al's got a well-deserved week off, so you're, you're stuck with me. But me and Sophie, we've yes. got our Sophie here today. Um, we've just come to tell you a little bit about Designer's Choice 12, a whole year of Designer Choice goodness. That's what you've had, a whole year, no. Sophie. Wow. I know, I know. So we're going to run through the dies with you. I've made some boards so you can see what they look like when they're cut. But what you get, that's what you want to know, don't you? You get, obviously, you've got your little folder because that fits in the, um, the, the A5 ones. Is it the A5, Dan? Yes. Yeah, the A5. And there's also the Thomas Choice ring binders. Oh, there is. <gasps> Have a look on the website. It's an absolutely gorgeous colour. It's really, really yeah, nice. Like eggshell glue. Yeah, nice. yeah. They've or they've duck made egg blue, duck egg glue. Yeah. yeah, they've made a lovely choice for that one. Yeah. So you've got these little wallets. That each one will come in a little wallet. I mean, it's an exclusive die set. It's limited edition. So once it's gone, it is gone. That is it. So you got to be quick. You got to be quick to get these. So you've got thirty-four dies on this little die set here. Thirty-four of them. Um, most of them are self-explanatory. You've got your outer edges and things. And then you've got a couple of little ones that will come to these when we go through the boards. And you'll know, you'll know what they mean then. So when you get yours, turn it up on your doorstep, you'll know what they do. Right. The main die here cuts the box shape. So you'll need two of these to make your carton. So I have cut it, I've put it on the board for you. But I've also cut it again to show you that you can either have this little slot in the top or not, basically, because it comes as a separate die. So you've got this little die here that will fit in and it pretty much fits the whole space. You can't put it in the wrong place. So it just it just fits in. So you've got that one. The other one I've cut in for you so you can see it is this little corner die because when you cut it, it stays in the cardstock. So it just gives you this dotted outer edge. So I really like that one. So I thought I'd show you that one because it's not really evident from, from the die itself to show you what it does. So that's your main die with your little, your little additions. You've got a base, obviously. And then with the circle, again, you've got a little addition with this one because you can either have the dotted circle with it that comes as a separate die. Or you can just put the sentiment, hello, sweet thing, which I think is lovely. Hello, sweet thing. So you can pop hello, sweet thing in there. Or you can put the both together. And then you've got the circle, the decorative circle as well. So that's one lot. Then I've cut all of these uh, pattern shapes in for you. So you've got, they're, obviously they're all verso. We always do verso dies. So you've got the, the plain shapes here. I've cut the plain shapes for you to see what they are as well. So you've got the plain shapes and then you've got this lovely, lovely decorative panel. It's all um, strawberries. Uh, this one's been designed by our Keris upstairs, I think. We got Keris on this one, yeah? Yes. Yeah. And it, it's just, just so cute, isn't it? I mean, look at these. This, they're such a, a lifelike little strawberry as well. They're, they're lovely. And then you've got... To get this panel in the centre here, you cut this main shape, which it looks like a little bit of an odd shape, but once you put it on, you can see that it'll fit with the two corners either side. So that's that's a nice one to do as well. So this corner then will flip and fit here, and that will fit the same as this. So you can either put a big panel in, or you can separate it off and have these. I've just cut the two um decorative panels into this one obviously you probably put the same rather than two odd panels like i have here um you've got this little triangle which fits just let me just show you one has anybody put it in yes we've got one here it just fits into this little into this little area here so it fits underneath the flap there so that's nice so that's that one there and you've got your plain and your decorative 
and then you've got these ones which fit on the lid we've also got some others that fit on the lid but like i say they they don't actually look as though they should because they just look like a line um it's this one here and this one here so this cuts that and this cuts that these are these are fab little dies i mean you can use these with any of your layers when you think of it you can either cut so you've got a drip coming down the side of your carton or on the lid of your carton there so you've got that that drip shape coming through and that's the way so i cut them there for you but i can see this one being like like a roof so i can see it like a bird house or something like that you know something something along those yeah, lines they're cute aren't they yeah. so that that's those two there you've also got the decorative one again verso that that fits it and these are orange or lemon slices whatever whatever fruit you want them to be grapefruit perhaps yeah you don't know uh, and then you've got for this little top piece the very top where you either put your slit you've got this uh plain uh die here or the little pattern one that goes in there so that is to cover the the top slit we've got what ones haven't i done i haven't done the fruit oh i love the fruit the strawberry is just the cutest thing it really really is so you can you can cut your strawberry pop a little bit of color on it i mean you can either uh color it in or you can paper piece it or mm. something you know snip that away and have a have a green one cut a green one first yeah. snip the strawberry bit off it and then put another one on top you've got an apple some cherries the melon is lush yeah i like the melon. love the watermelon a little bite out of it yeah yeah and the um segment piece then which is either any of the citrus fruits isn't yeah it? Lemon, orange lemon, lemon whatever whatever you want and you've got to have a teeny tiny butterfly oh yeah who wouldn't mm -hmm. who wouldn't want a little butterfly on it um you've got a little tag here and you've got a little sentiment and it says goodies goodies is so yeah. cute so you've got goodies you can give somebody a little box of goodies or a little box of sweet treats this is so sweet it really really is but this sentiment also fits into the tag so you can swap those about uh the last one was this last straight die wasn't it now this one cuts the whole piece in half so if you cut that there you've got a dotted line either side and you can either put a different color underneath or something like that but it's nice just to add a little bit of difference to it so those are all your dies so we've gone through those do you want to show some of your samples yeah. there so yes well as you just mentioned the one that cuts it in half you've got it there yeah. oh fab so, yes, it's just fab like a little almost like a wave going around they're great them. aren't they yeah they're lovely so this one says you're one in a melon oh <laughs> i love and that that's christine from, yeah, yeah christine christine with her, her little dymo maker the label maker oh i looked everywhere oh, for what it is oh, yes a label maker okay. yeah I looked Good. everywhere for one. I just couldn't find one anywhere. No, no, no not at all. We've got another melon. So this one's got the goodies sentiment on it and hello sweet thing as well. Oh. well that's a cute idea as well to keep it to closed keep it closed. Yeah, yeah, if you, then don't, you don't have to rip it open. Yeah, if you, you don't want to um, put ribbon or anything. Yeah. Sometimes it's cleaner without the ribbon, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice. This one's from Jen. Yeah, Jen Gray. Uh, Jen Gray. Yeah, and this one. I love this one. That's another Christine. That was look. It's different, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, really cute. You are ugly, brilliant. She's like, <laughs> she oh, loves then. a pen. Yeah, love a pen. <laughs> yeah, Christine then. And then this one, the cute little strawberries mm -hmm. and the panels. Oh, Christine's cut the strawberries away, like yeah, I said. Yeah, and fab. With a little, uh, with a little tag at the top. top. This almost reminds me of that, like William Morris wallpaper. Yes, you know, it, it does. Yeah, it's it does. Really nice. It's quite. It's more lifelike, isn't it, yeah, than uh, than anything else? Yeah. Is this one Christine? That's Christine. Yeah, Christine again. Yeah. I like the little cord as well on top yeah this that's a top. that's a tonic one yeah yeah we've got one of and those then we've got and this one says sweet treats going around oh i like a the panels. three panels going down the side yeah and then the little segment in the oh side. yes that sure fits right see. in there 
see that in there. That's lovely. So yeah, this coat and a little matching ribbon. Who's that one? It. This one is Victoria. Ah, lovely. Thanks, Very Vicky. Coat. A bit of a different um, colour scheme as well, more citrus. Yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. We've it's got a lot ginger. with the strawberries just because of this beautiful panel, I yeah. think. I mean, it, it, it is quite striking, isn't it? So we've got from Shilpa, so I've got this one here where she's coloured the strawberry in, used the tag and the Hello Sweet thing, and the butterflies, got to have some butterflies. And she's coloured these panels right the way around. They're absolutely beautiful. So, and, and sealed it off then with the um, decorative dye at the top. Mm -hmm. So that's beautiful. Thanks, Shilpa. We've got this one that's been paper pieced. So it's been cut in the green and then cut again in red and just had the little strawberries trimmed out and popped on the top. And the, the strawberry again, paper pieced on the sides. So they're lovely. And this one's got the um, little triangle piece for the, the top there with the slit cut into it. And a lovely little straw. Oh, that's with cute. With strawberry on the straw. And nice little goodies. Goodies for us. And that again is from Victoria. Thanks, Vicky. This is a lovely one too. Another coloured. Oh, this is Ruth. Another coloured um, strawberry. And Ruth does beautiful colouring. Mm. Absolutely gorgeous. And the sweet treats on the side of this one. Just to, to have a little difference on it. But she's put some of the tonic gems on as well, which is lovely. Those beautiful clear gemstones just to catch the light. So that's lovely. Thanks, Ruth. It's another coloured one. Who is this from? Oh, we've got one without a name. Oh, no. Oh, no. We can't tell you who it's from. If you're watching <laughs> and this is yours, let Sophie know. She's got the comments up. Yeah. <laughs> and we can say who it is. But it's coloured in beautifully. It's absolutely gorgeous. And we've got a little bit. I don't even know if you can pick it up because we've got a bit of shimmer on this one as well. We've gone over the strawberries with the with one of the shimmer pens. So that's gorgeous. So that's been um it's been coloured on both sides there. So I like that colour scheme as well. You wouldn't necessarily think to put No, navy I know, with that navy with it. But yeah, it, it makes it pop, doesn't it, does. it? It makes the whole thing pop. I know this one's from Vicky. I had a look at this one earlier and I thought, oh, wow. Because it reminds me so much of a Halloween mm. box. But, of course, it's it's a strawberry, isn't it? Uh, uh, an orange. Yeah. It's got the orange slice oh, on yeah. it. So it's an orange juice box. I mean, if you're as old as me, which you are not, so you'd remember, you'd remember having a carton of milk in school. So I you know, to I see, don't to know see when we did. I think we did it. No, maybe not a carton, a little juice box. Oh, milk, did you? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> lovely. But this one is lovely because Jen has taken it and she's made it more vintage by just using the outer edge shapes and popping some um, fussy cut pieces mm. on it. But it's so pretty lovely lovely papers and it says art is the journey of a free soul oh very nice so yeah i like that one vicky's made a double layer which wow look at the size of that that's amazing i love that and she's put all drops on your crystal drops i think it's the ivory seashell oh i named that Why drop not? in one <laughs> <laughs> and again a lovely little clip a binder clip just to to hold the thing together because you haven't even seen inside i mean goodness me look at the size on this box i know this is a double but wow they really are quite spacious you can get a lot of uh lindors in these down mm. do you think i don't i don't know the actual lindor count but i think it's quite a few and our last one with an array an array of fruits on the front is from shilpa and she's popped some uh pattern paper from one of our pads i think mm. uh with the sweet treats and the goodies on it so that's, that's nice. a lovely alternative the, we know who the navy one is <gasps> who it is, is it it's ruth oh said. ruth your name's fallen yeah, off name oh off. sorry <laughs> oh i'm glad you've let us know yes. i'm really glad you've let us know so this is on our website now dan mm -hmm. yep so we're all live on the website and it's 19.99 whether you're in the US or the UK. So just pop along to Tonic Studios website and you can place your order. Remember, you've got to be quick because it's once it's gone, it's gone. That's it. Exclusive. <laughs> Thanks for joining us today. Uh, we'll see you again.